Hey, hey, rules. I'm bleeding all over the place. Hey, welcome back everybody to Surf Neat. I'm Anthony, and as you can see by the title, this is a little bit of a different video. Um, I want to let you in, let you know what's kind of been going on with my life. And um, yeah, I went to the doctor and he pretty much told me I got about 10 more good years to live. So let me tell you a little bit what's going on. So I've been gaining weight and losing weight. I've been waking up at night like 30 minutes, every 30 minutes to an hour and having to use the bathroom. And I've been extremely thirsty. So after a while I end up going to the doctor and um, come to find out I got diabetes, type two diabetes. So. I went to the doctor and they tested my blood sh blood sugar and it was off off the chain. It was absolutely ridiculous. Um so I had so much sugar in my in my body. My body is trying to get it out by urinating it out. I'm sorry if it's a little bit graphic. Um so even the test it was higher than the test would even recognize. So I've been having to take this medicine, I've been having to take this, I took classes, and you go through different kind of steps. So if I continue the way I'm going and eating the way I'm eating, then um, obviously then it's not going to be a good thing. So pretty much he said I have about 10 years before I have to would start dialysis, I'll probably lose some limbs, eyesight will be gone, and um, pretty much it will be my deathbed. On that. So uh, lately I've been taking it really serious. Um, I've been eating different and taking my medicine and it's it's kind of a pain in the butt <laughs> to be honest with you but you know you got to do what you got to do and hopefully at one point I can get off the medicine and be healthy and um, live, live a healthy life. So um, I also got back into the gym. I've been trying to work out as much as possible. I do work a lot and I do this, uh, taking care of family and all of that stuff. So it, I do have a pretty busy life. But I'm gonna let you in and what's going on. And then also on Instagram and, and uh, YouTube, I'll be making videos, letting everybody know what, when I drink something, how much my blood sugar will go up. So I would be taking uh, doing tests before and after and we were going to be looking at the product and seeing how much blood sugars my blood sugar will go up because alcohol does affect uh, it different than just eating foods. Okay, so um, the first medicine I take two times, two pills in the morning and two times at night. It's metformin. A lot of people that are on diabetes knows that uh, I think almost everybody takes metformin, right? Um, and then also one time a week, I uh, shoot this up, Trulicity. Um, that I take one time a week, so I do it on Monday when I do a whole bunch of paperwork and stuff like that. So I just get that out the way with because it's just a routine. And then one time a day, I try to do it in the morning. I shoot myself up with similar if, if pronounce it right so that's one time a day and then also um, with my diabetes with the blood sugar in my body I take uh, Lipitrol um, one time a day so those are the medicines I take to test your uh, blood sugar um, you get one of these right so we're gonna be doing that because today I'm going to also be trying uh, this beer right here Okay, so we're going to be trying this, and then we're going to do it before and after, and um, and then hopefully, if you have diabetes and you enjoy a drink, um, you can kind of go along. Now, of course, I'm not a doctor, um, and everybody's body is different, so just because mine goes up a couple of points doesn't mean yours doesn't or yours does, so just be careful of that, and it's just informational. Parts. So first, what we're going to do is we're going to prick ourselves. We're going to clean. Um, we're going to clean the finger, right? Nice and clean. 
Let me get this ready though. We're gonna pull this back. You pull this back right here and then there's a button right here you can press and it uh, pretty much pokes yourself. It doesn't really hurt. Uh, it is annoying. So it depends on how many times a day you have to do it. Some people have to do it every single time they eat and before and after. And when you first start off, that's kind of what you do. Um, I don't do it as often as that, but again, you poke your fingers and you get little dots on your fingers, little calluses after a while. So it's, again, it's kind of a pain in the butt. But I like to use this finger right here because it hurts the least. You just put it right here on the side, which is fine. And then um, you just poke it. Boom. And then, as you can see, a little blood comes out. You actually do want to wipe this first one off because it still has the dirt and stuff like that on it. And then you just squeeze it out again. I don't know if you can see it very well, right? There you go, that's good enough. You take this and you poke it. Not poke it, but you just have it on there. So let's see what my blood sugar level is is 118 so we're going to start off with 118 and now we're going to enjoy this beer it is by energy city brewing company it is briscoe crumble or raspberry and blackberry it is a flavored berlin style half of beer it contains real fruit for full consistent flavor swirl the can before serving so definitely want to do that it's probably pretty thick okay so I'm gonna swirl it a little bit. Um, the beer content on this one, let me see, it is 6.5. It's one point, of course, keep cold to ref keep it refreshed. So let's try it. So we got a glass here, right? And we're gonna put a beer in it. Ooh, ooh, very thick, very thick. It almost looks like Coke a little bit, on this side at least. Coke and orange juice, right? It is weird. It's almost, it does almost taste like a Bloody Mary also. Um, strange. I don't know how I feel about it. It's kind of, it's kind of crazy. So it's a fruitful Bloody Mary with soda water. I don't know how I feel. It has good flavor to it. I'm not a Bloody Mary kind of person, really. I've been trying a lot of thick beer, um, you know, which... So I don't know if I would call it a half of ice. I mean, obviously, that is what it is. But... Man, this is strange. So it has a really good flavor to it, but it's just so surprising how, how it comes together and, and it tastes and it feels. It's definitely not something I would drink every single day. It is really cool to try though. I'm gonna keep on drinking it. For somebody that hasn't tried it, this is how I would describe it, 100%. It is a fruity Bloody Mary with seltzer water in it, okay? So if that's your thing, definitely try it. Real surprising to me. But anyways, we're gonna be back in about 20 minutes and let's check our blood sugar at this point. Again, it was 118 before, and now we're gonna drink it and we're gonna finish the can, the whole entire can, and then we're going to test it again to see how high it went up. And obviously it's not gonna go down, but uh, yeah, so I'll see you in a second. All right, now it's been more than 20 minutes. We're gonna test again to see what the difference is. And then, um, yeah, so there we go. So what I wanna do again, I'm gonna pick a different finger this time. I'm gonna wipe it down again. Get my little puncher and uh, just pick a side. It's this finger, boop, right here. Squeeze a little bit, right? If you can see it, squeeze a little bit, wipe it down. We're gonna squeeze a little bit more out. Get 
here we're going to squeeze a little bit more out all right and then remember um the last time it was at 118 and yeah, this should be enough and let's test it so 135 Okay, so the first one was 118. The second one afterwards, it is 135. Okay, so it went up 18 points. On one can, it went up 18 points on that one. So I can imagine if I were to drink six of them, what that score would be then. And, then. and again, I haven't eaten anything yet. Okay, so we're going to be trying out more and more. Uh, just vodkas, bourbons. We're gonna be trying different beers, maybe some wines, um, and then post them about it. So again, follow us on Instagram uh, if you like this kind of stuff and want to see more. Um, don't forget to like and subscribe. We also have a TikTok and all of that stuff. So thank you very much. And as always, serve it neat.